has zero sugar and it's gluten free. I don't think I want that because ain't shit left in it. <laughs> what's up friends welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel it is your girl kaylani also known as Kay, and we're kicking off another video guys i miss y'all if this is your first time here hey hello how are you what have you been up to so glad that you stopped through and i hope that you stay like comment subscribe and share this video with everyone you know and i do mean everyone and for all my returning subscribers y'all give me a hug with my one shoulder shirt on and on and on I'm being fast. Y'all know I love a good holy and ho um, ensemble. Anyway, um, y'all, I ain't been doing shit, y'all. Oh, before we get into this video, y'all, guess what I found today? You're not going to believe it. First of all, I'm mad because my grandchildren don't even know what it is. I found a, a payphone. I didn't even know, y'all, look. I didn't even know they still had pay phones. And it's 50 cents. I thought it would be $50 by now as high as everything else is going up. And who the hell is stopping to use it? Um, anyway, I know, y'all. That's how my mind goes. But what y'all been up to? Tell me y'all business. I ain't heard it in a minute. I ain't been up to nothing but trying to eat healthy because, baby, I've been 51 almost. Uh, I've been 25 twice, carried one for almost a month, and Ooh, child, they want you to do everything. They want you to put them boobs up in the chamber. Now, I've been doing that since my 40s, so I'm kind of used to that. But what I'm not used to is that he want to do a colonoscopy. I thought that was like 55. I'm like, I don't like the way I feel after leaving the doctor today, this time. Like, I mean, I ain't got it done yet, but I'm just saying, like, this is just too much. But I guess you got to do it so you can stay healthy. But yeah, yeah. if you don't know, you know now that um, I've been going to Starbucks a little, a little more than usual. And that's only because I had a gift certificate. And with this gift certificate, I've been getting this little turkey pesto and mozzarella uh, sandwich. And it's so good. It's on chipotle bread. But after talking to the doctor, I literally have to get away from the bread, not so much bread. So I'm a tr I we stopped. We went to Aldi's. I didn't take y'all with me because I did. <laughs> We've been to Aldi several times, but I just really ran in there to get some ingredients that was on the sandwich. So we got us some turkey. We got us some mozzarella. Now I really think that they have the other thick mozzarella. That was way too expensive. This is, this is more in my price range. So we're going to use this. We got some pesto. And we got some sun-dried tomatoes. Now, first of all, let's talk about these sun-dried tomatoes. This was the highest goddamn thing out of everything that I picked up. And I ain't even showed you the bread yet. But this was $5.27 at Aldi's. So, why is the dried out tomato more expensive than the actual fresh tomato? I feel like you should have been giving this away with a purchase. I don't want to use this very little at a time because I need it to last as long as possible. The hell? Anyway. So, since we're trying to do better, we got these buns. These were $4.00. I, I I understand the keto stuff is hot, but I don't understand this. This was like ten dollars for just these two things. Anyway, so we got these keto bread, these keto buns. Now they're super soft. Let's start there. I like that, and I, and I think for four dollars, that's not too bad for eight buns, and it's keto, and it says vegan. It has nine grams of protein and one net carb. So it's zero guilt. Don't take my word for it. That's what it say on the package. Anyway, y'all, we're going to fix one of those. Um, yeah, and see what it tastes like, y'all. So 
Y'all ain't doing shit else. Pull up a seat, grab you something to drink, and let's fix us a sandwich. Because I'm hungry. I know y'all. We supposed to have been cooking. But guess what? I ain't even ate. I still got to fix something to eat. It is 8 o'clock. We we still gotta eat. I just I took a bath, put on PJs, put on Tupac, my specs, and here we are. Hold on, babe. Can you fix dinner tonight for us? Y'all heard that? <laughs> Me neither. Ain't nobody here. I'm just practicing shit. too tired to eat y'all i've been working and when i say working i've been doing some of my full-time work some of my gig work and my youtube work i am exhausted i need to edit a video that needs to, that has to go up in the morning yes <laughs> in 12 hours and in that time i need to eat sleep rest oh, i'm tired I guess I'm finna put on, um, till I feel like fixing me something to eat, I guess I'm gonna put, um, put on the BET Awards. Y'all seen it? If y'all seen it, don't tell me about it. Let me, I'm gonna watch it. Um, yeah. I think I'm gonna go ahead and fall asleep on the BET Awards and then talk to, <laughs> then talk to y'all about it. Um. And when I say fall asleep, child, I'll put it on. Fall asleep, then you hear it. You can hear it. Well, I can hear it sometimes because I don't sleep super, super hard. So, I don't know. But I know I ain't finna be on this damn camera long. You know why? Because I didn't turn the fans off. Y'all know it be sounding like a submarine space shuttle over here with all them, all my damn fans and concoctions on. The ceiling fan is on, but that ain't enough. And then I'm over here, y'all. Look. Y'all see that? That ain't... God, that ain't no band-aid. It's a pain patch. Bitch, I'm over here smelling like two pounds of goddamn Bengay. I got one on my neck and one on my shoulders. Y'all, I am over this shit being 51. It's just... Girl, that ain't attractive. How I be trying to lay here all sexy and shit with pain patches and shit smelling like the mentholator? That's a... The hell? Take the wheel and the gas pedal. Oh, girl, where's Benjamin Button when you need him? I need whatever potion he use so I can go backwards. Shit. Ooh. Anyway, I figured if I take me a little power nap, I had the strength to edit this damn video. I had a question, though, before I close my eyes. What's in y'all Amazon cart for Prime Day? <laughs> What y'all order? Because I don't know if this video coming out before prom day or after. What's in y'all court? What y'all order? Put it down in the comments. I'm curious to know. Did y'all order something off my list? Off my Amazon video? If you want to know, if you haven't seen it yet, I'm going to link it. Look, look down in the description box. <sighs> okay, y'all. I'm for real this time. We're going to take us a little nap, and then we're going to get up. Girl, well, why am I looking <laughs> cockeyed? I promise I'm not, y'all. I'll be, girl, look over here, shit. <sighs> and the baby need a nap. Let me take a nap, y'all. And hopefully I don't wake up tomorrow. <laughs> wake up in a couple hours so I can get this video edited. And ready for y'all tomorrow. Be back in a few. Took the Tupac out because I just didn't feel right cooking over the stove with the Tupac on. So, me and him, we got our little pan, child. I don't know why, it, what took me so long to, oh girl, I had to sit y'all up on something. Hold on. Let me sit y'all up because I got y'all in my little Amazon cradle that I told y'all I take. I got it work in here. I'm still sleeping. But we gotta fix us something to eat, cause 
we just got to. And I don't know why I'm procrastinating like we cooking this shit from scratch. I mean, it's turkey. I mean, it's turkey for crying out loud. I'm basically just warming this shit up. So, there's that. We washed our hands for somebody who think I ain't washed my hands. Um... Yeah, y'all. Oh, I mean, this better be fresh, fresh. I'm tearing up. Still got my little patches on. I, in case you were wondering, I got about 76 of these little pajamas and uh, little top and bottom. I got them from, you guessed it, Didi's. And they're three ninety nine. They're so comfortable, y'all. I would say definitely go over there and get you some, child. Oh, this turkey smells good unless I'm just that hungry. Let me see. Girl, the damn buns ain't that big. Do we want one bun or two? <laughs> I don't know. This it ain't like this meat cheap, so. What? Just, we gonna do two. I don't think I can eat two. I don't know. Let's see, look, the damn turkey's starting to bubble up already. She, it's almost done, and here I am getting feel like doing it. Oh god! I'm just exhausted. I just exhausted, child. I was gonna fix me a little dessert, some strawberries, but I don't. I gotta wash them, cut them, and all that. I don't feel like doing all that. I'm still having a hard time with this damn sandwich. This little turkey sandwich. And it better be good. <laughs> I got out of bed for this. Y'all, I've been having tension in my neck for like all week. Like, ooh. And it, it really builds up at night. I don't know if I'm sleeping bad. I think I need to. God damn, this bread's so soft. I mean, it's keto. Like, this shit's soft. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's like. Hold on, y'all. I don't want to burn my shit up. Come on. Don't laugh, but it's like what I like to call tuna fish bread. You ever get some bread? <laughs> Some bread from the store that be so soft and you put tuna fish on it and the tuna fish be so good it stick like to the top of your mouth. Yeah, that's tuna fish bread. That's what this feel like, bitch. It's like pillows. I almost don't even want to toast it. And I don't think it'll taste right if I don't. Ugh. So we got our buns. Let me just show y'all. We got our buns and meat. Nothing special. <laughs> Am I supposed to cook the uh the sun dried tomato? Y'all ever ate sun dried <laughs> sun dried tomatoes before? Oh Lord, all this damn oil and shit in there. Jesus, hold on. You don't want to burn that nut. What do you mean, bitch? <laughs> Disrespectful and shit. We don't warm it up just in case. I mean, I guess it couldn't hurt. Okay. Baby, I swear this must be this these sun dried uh, sun dried tomatoes must be made with angel dust or something because I still can't wrap my head around that five dollars or something for the for this damn jar. Oh I think I'm putting too much on there. Okay. I think that's all we need. We just put a little bit on there because we're gonna make this layer. <laughs> I think I put too many push it, too much turkey meat on here. Let me see. All right. All right, we got shit popping over here, baby. Well, we don't want to burn that. Ooh, Lord, the pot moving. Wait a minute. Let me turn this shit down. Okay. It better be good. I'm gonna get the cheese. Let's get our moon Oh, Lord. Jesus. Let me 
Australia. Lord, I almost burned my five dollars. Oh, uh, girl, let me move this pan. I almost burned my little five dollar uh my five dollars sun dried tomato. Girl, they looking like burnt bacon almost. Oh Okay. We salvaged it. Our bread's still soft. Got a little toast on it. Oh, should we? Okay, let's do this. Let's put our meat. Girl, I be getting out of frame, honey. I, I don't. Y'all know I'm all dirt. Put a little cheese. Okay. All right. I be hating that pesto do that at the top. Oh, girl, I don't want to waste no good pesto juice. Hold on. Okay. Let me see. All right, let's mix that up because that got a bunch of oil on the top too. See y'all, I'm I'm basically done. I don't know why I was bullshitting and didn't want to come in here and do this because I was lazy. I've been up working like it was a regular day. I started working about six. I stopped about three, and that was the other two jobs. And then about, I whined and whined and whined and looked at all the stuff and was like, oh, geez, so I don't feel like filming. I did that for about two hours, and then I got up and filmed, and now it's like 8.45. I don't like to eat this late, but I got a little headache because I'm hungry. Girl, it's just so... Oh. Over pesto the shit. I literally pretty much burned the damn thing. I hope it tastes good. The damn sun died. baby for five dollars you wasn't supposed to burn. But then again, I don't know if I was supposed to cook it or not. Y'all ain't tell told me that. All right. I feel like this too much meat and cheese. Okay, which one is the top? Wait a minute. Now I feel like the damn shit is. Did I cook it too much? Oh, girl, I should have just went back to fucking, uh. Okay, yeah, put the damn sun dry. The tomatoes on now. Hold on. I should have just went back to, uh, Star Starbucks and just let them do what they do. Char charge you, uh, two kidneys for a fucking sandwich and a coffee. I should just let them do it because... I'm getting shit everywhere. I don't know if it's going to taste good. I don't know. Well, we here now, so. Putting the little tomatoes on there. Okay, it ain't that burning. They kind of burn. They like crispy. Oh, we're going to come back and wash the dishes. All right, y'all. So, we done put the sandwich together. We didn't put the sandwich together, child. Let me show y'all what we got. Cooking with K, baby. Cooking with K. Yes, I put it on a paper plate. So I already got to clean the pan that I didn't use. You want me to clean the plate too? I don't want to do that. Shit, I didn't want to fix the food in the beginning. And you see how long it took? It ain't take long at all. Hold on, all my cheese. Stick it to the up. Oh, the bread. Look how, look how bread. Look how soft. Let's see. It's pretty good. That's good. Even with the crispy sun dried tomatoes, it's good. good. Here's the gotcha though. I only have an appetite for one. So, get these at the Dollar Tree. These are my absolute favorites. A staple in my house. I keep these. It's just a little foil strip. It comes in handy if you like warming something up in the oven. At, up in the office. In the oven and stuff. Or in the toaster oven or whatever. So, we're just going to do this. 
because uh, I'm going to let it cool off on the stove for now. And then we'll put it up. We probably just warm that up for my breakfast or something. I'm going to go in here and um, relax. Put on a BET Awards. Edit this video because it has to go out in the morning. And then I'll be back. What's up, friends? We back. In the car and rolling. Um, I, we're out getting ready to. I gotta make a couple of stops. Oh, here we go. Jumping around. Jesus. That's because it's traffic. Anyway, um, here we go. Jumping around. We're about to. I broke my sandal my go-to sandals so we're gonna go try to replace those uh, we're gonna go to shoe deal and see what they have um, hopefully hopefully we can find something good y'all so yeah um, I just didn't want to pop up in there so want to let y'all know when we was going first so when we get up in shoe deal Pick the camera back up. This one's for the lovers. If you're out there, let me hear you say, Yeah, 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 Oh my God, y'all. I'm so sick. I, I don't know where to go. I do know where to go find some shoes from, but I don't want to spend that type of money on there. Baby, y'all seen what was up in there. Baby, them, them damn sandals had rubber bands and shit attached to it. Fucking safety pins, barber pins. I can't. <laughs> I can't do that. I'm, I'm not going to be able to do that. So, we back on the road. Um, I need to stop at uh, the store and pick up some uh, some what you call it? SD cards because I think I don't know if I told y'all in this video or what girl I can't even keep up no more but um, that was last video when I was filming we ran out of storage and I'm like oh I don't have the time in July to move everything over. I need to. I already. I really. Oh, girl. I got. I'm gonna have to make time because we got plans for the next couple of weekends, and I. I, I need. I need the storage on my phone and stuff. So we're gonna have to make time. But until then, we going to get us some memory cards because it won't be no excuse for us picking up the camera. So they were. Um. I got two two hundred and fifty six gigabytes and. Um, $17 or something like that. I don't know if it's a scale. I'm a little bit scared of them. So let's go and get them and I'll be back. Oh yeah, I did find some shoes in Shoe Deal, but they wasn't the sandals I was looking for. I'll show y'all those when we get to the house. All these per use. And we came in all these because y'all, I think we gonna do us a ghetto white wine taste in a night. So yeah, we're gonna pick up some wine. Probably do like a little charcuterie. So let's pick up some wine, I'll be right back. This is 
not something they carry all the time. So, pink lemonade. I don't know. I don't know. It's giving liquor store. Oh, oh, look. This one has zero sugar and it's gluten free. I don't think I want that because ain't shit left in it. <laughs> It's 85 calories. What y'all think? It's 799. I think we should try it. What y'all think? So far we got. So far we got. Yeah, maybe all the eyes. I can feel them on my neck. It's, it's driving me crazy. I'm gonna get one more bottle. I think, and we're going to, I'm going to show y'all everything, because I, I still got other stuff I got to show y'all, and I'll show y'all when we get to the house. All right, y'all, what's up? We back. We have made it to the house. It is a few hours later. I think the last time we picked up the phone, we were at Aldi's picking up us a, um, a surprise, y'all, so that's coming up next but before we get into that i do want to show you guys a little show and tell because that's what we do what would we i mean who would i be if i didn't tell you show y'all something and tell y'all something about something that i didn't picked up so y'all y'all know early y'all know earlier in the vlog we went to shoe deal boo we went to shoe deal and we picked up we picked us up some shoes y'all these were um they were ten dollars. Then they were they were twelve dollars. Then it was marked to two dollars, and then they end up being seven dollars with my little percentage off. I absolutely love these. Yes, we have something kind of on the same wavelength as, as these, but the heel is taller and thicker. It's not black like this. This is more sleek, and I can wear more stuff with these. So, and they tie off the leg. Oh, girl, yeah, she gonna be this. So we got that. And then no, no shopping spree will be complete without my favorite store. Let's say it together. Dee Dee's. <laughs> Y'all, I love her. Isn't she cute? She was um $14. It is the season for something like this. Y'all. I actually will pull that off with them shoes. Maybe. I don't know. But if I wanted to, I could. What y'all think? What y'all do? Y'all love this little bag. I ain't going crazy in DDs like I normally do. But y'all, I needed this bag. Can y'all see it? Y'all look. It's genuine leather. At least that's what the tags say. I like it. It's giving like a male satchel. But... <laughs> But for a female, I really like this bag, y'all. I think it's more of a vacation bag. This is something if you want to get to your stuff real quick. I love it. I love it because it doesn't zip up and you're out and about. You don't have to worry about somebody trying to pickpocket you because they have to open up this in order to get to your stuff. I love this for a travel bag. So, yeah, this is this is my ish right here. So we didn't do too bad, y'all. And then we fancy because this was regular $79. Of course, I didn't pay $79 for it. But that's how much it's worth. So yeah, y'all. Y'all. I'm getting a little tired. Uh, my girl, Kimberly P, just went off of her first life. Congratulations, boo. Um, I'm so proud of you. Uh, so, with that being said... I'm about to show y'all something. We're about to take five. And I'm going to show y'all something real cute. This is for y'all. Stay tuned. Yeah. Hey, y'all. What y'all doing? Glad y'all here. Come on in. I got something for you. Our ratchet is wine tasting. <laughs> what the time, girl? I went all out for y'all. We got a little sand. We got a little wine from Aldi's. We got our glasses from the dollar store. Like, yeah, we got a little charcuterie. 
Okay, I really didn't make it. I want. I didn't. I didn't really make it. We went to ATV and picked it up. It's six dollars. There we go. Now that's better. That's better. All right, y'all. So we picked up these four wines. We have Cannon Road, and this is a Pinot Grigio. Oh, girl, why y'all didn't tell me that if you put the bottles in the freezer for like thirty minutes, they good. They ready to go. We got this. You pronounce it, cause I ain't finna mess the name up. Watermelon flavor. Winky Owl. Girl, is that Winky? Yeah. Winky Owl. Sangria. And then we got this Pini Colada. <laughs> so, yeah. And I got four different glasses y'all I bought out. I went to the um, Delantra .25, the dollar store. Yeah, we spent six dollars on these four glasses. <laughs> Ew. Okay. Okay, let's start with this little Pinot first, y'all. And while we while we get into these drinks, y'all tell me. Tell me y'all business. <laughs> tell me y'all business. Y'all know what? Okay. Baby, you know this shit cheap. We probably need to go get us some Excedrin. Because I just realized. <laughs> I took the top off. I ain't even use a cork. Jesus take the wheel. Y'all say a little prayer for my little. She is. Oh, and if you're looking at the spots in this wet, they clean. I don't know how to, that ain't my forte trying to shine, shine them up and, uh, no. They clean. Hence why you see the spots. But here y'all, let's see. Let's see what this tastes like. Is it worth, I think this one was like, $3.95. See, <laughs> you don't gonna get you some excedrin. You just said this shit was $3.95 and now you finna turn yourself into a whole human ass blender by blending all this shit up together. Oh Lord, okay. We probably gonna have to clean our palate after each one. What am I supposed to clean my palate with though? Y'all know? <laughs> put it down in the comments. Bitch gonna be drunk by then, but <laughs> go and put it in the comments anyway. So I know for future references. Okay, I'm procrastinating. The wine gonna fuck around and get warm. Hold on. It tastes like Pinot. <laughs> um, it's actually good. It's really good. Oh yeah, that's good. That's good. I can. We're gonna come back to that. Hold on. <laughs> let, let, me, let, me try, let me pair it with a little gray. Baby, I almost forgot y'all was down. And grabbed me a handful and shook them damn grapes up like Skittles and. <laughs> Sit down with this bottle of wine. That's good. That was definitely worth the four dollars. Okay, y'all. Next, we're gonna open up the sangria. Now I've been seeing this sangria in there for a minute, and um, I just never picked it up. But here we are, now, girl. Wait a minute. Let's see. Girl, let me check the. Let me check the bottle, cause my girl Genovia bought some uh Genovia Riel. Y'all go follow her too. She bought some wine from the dollar store. Was it the dollar store, girl? Comment down below. And baby, we had to throw that wine away. I said we. Cause I feel like I was a part of it too. Let me check my bottle, child. Oh, we look good. We look good. Oh, I like the way this red. I think my tongue swallowed. I love it. I love it. Hopefully, they say alcohol helps, so. <laughs> Maybe not this alcohol, but shit. This is all we got. Here, cheers. I'm a little nervous, but okay.
That's good. I'm sorry, I was, <laughs> I paused for a minute because I'm like, if you say sangria, I feel like it's gonna taste like sangria. Then it occurred to me that I haven't had sangria by itself in a long time, so bitch, what are you comparing it to? So that was the third sip, and then like the second sip. And like the third sip, I'm like, I really paid attention. So the first sip, I wasn't really paying attention. The second sip, I was like, but I don't know if this tastes like the sangria I had. And then the third sip was like, well, bitch, you ain't never had it, so this it. Now, we are going to um, rate these. These wines from a one to five. We got already two wines down. I'm feeling tipsy already. Don't judge me. One being bad, five being good. Four and a half. Four and a half. These, I would definitely say, when you are in Aldi, pick these two up. You will not be disappointed. First of all, let's talk about how they list them five dollars. It tastes really, really good. So if you're having like an event and you're trying to slap some shit together, or it's a Sunday and the liquor store ain't open, get you one of these. Get both of them. I've been not filming. Okay, but if y'all look at my my uh my timeline, it looks like I have, so I don't want to say that, but I've been watching I've been watching Tubi movies lately. And the YouTube, of course, that goes without saying. I done been watching some new ones that I've been enjoying. But I've been on Tubi. I started, hold on y'all. Oh girl, another twisted top. See this one here was, this one here threw me out. Cause it had the little foil on top. So yeah, I'm thinking, I don't know. I, I don't know why I didn't think it was a twisty top. So, so far, you don't need a wine opener for these. So, yeah, I'm, oh, it's got a little fuzz in it. Oh, Lord. All right. This is the... Something in my glass. It was a soot. <laughs> Woo! We just getting this party started. Kind of sorta, of, cause we ain't got but one drink left. But let me see. This right here, then. This right. This all right. You're not, you're not really a wine drinker, but it's Sunday, about two o'clock, and you fresh out of alcohol, and you want something to drink, go to Aldi. Go to Aldi. Get this. I've had the peach one before. So good. But this one, I don't know how long this one is going to be, and uh, the flavor is going to be around, but this one is good. The peach is good, too. You can't go wrong with either one of them. But this is my first time having that. That's good. Alright, y'all. Can I cop this pina colada and y'all live? It's beach colado. I'm scared, Chad. Because this one got milk in it. Let me see if it don't even look like it do. Um, ooh, jeez, take the wheel. That is not ladylike. But y'all in my house. <laughs> so. Here we go. So let's pour some of this. I don't want to pour a lot. I'm nervous. Oh, girl. That was another twisty top. First of all, yeah, we want to fold a little bit in here. I don't know if I want to tear this. This shit throwing me out. Because I don't like milk. 
Fun fact. I don't. Unless it got a little cereal tossed into it. I don't like it. And then, if the milk get warm, I ain't gonna make it do it. I gotta pump like two ice cubes in it. Y'all, yeah, I'm weird. We're gonna try because can I do the review so you don't have to. So here we go. Let's see what this tastes like. Maybe I don't want to have that. Maybe we should try this white cheese. First of all, what is this black shit on this white cheese? I probably should have read the package. Because it's giving my cheese spoiled on one side. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Ew. If you know what type of cheese that is, <laughs> put it in the comments. Oh Lord, girl, I messed up my whole pile of bitch. I think I need to swallow some bleach. Hold on. Well, safe to say that cheese ain't gonna make it to the refrigerator. Anyway, in the words of Jay Kareem, down the hatch, a quarter patch it. enough for it to get like a little chill as long as it can without there the wine freeze I know alcohol don't but do wine I mean cuz wine don't have as much alcohol in it it's alcohol okay that made sense in my head but anyway baby this is good this right here one of five this is seven this, Okay, this one here is $5.99. These two were $3.95. And this was $7.99. It was worth me going. It was worth this one being expensive. It's expensive. Baby, this is good. Now, okay, now that we done tasted everything, we done rated everything, let's talk about how we would pair these things. Now, this right here, if you're drinking with your man, this would pair good with Kanye. Kanye would pair good with this. Kanye or even a bourbon. A bourbon. Baby, if you get that and, and put a splash of one of those in there, oh, it's going to top it off. It's a wrap. You're going to have a good night. For sure. For sure. This. It's not super sweet. It has a really good flavor to it. Um, if I was going to pair this with something, it would definitely be tequila. Yeah, it would definitely be tequila. For sure. This right here, by itself. Hands down by itself. And this one right here, I would do by itself as well. Unless you're not a real wine drinker. And then I always say, I always say if you're not a drinker, but that's all they have, and you got that, go ahead, order your glass of wine, and tell them to put a shot of grenadine. 
Thank you, lady. Add a grenadine in there. It doesn't even have to. It doesn't even have to be grenadine. It could be grenadine. It could be a peach flavor. It could be uh, the blue Caruso. I think that's how you pronounce it. Any one of those will add flavor to that. That will be. That will make you a wine drinker. So, yes. Thank you, guys. Y'all. So, how did y'all enjoy our little wine tasting? Be honest. Put it down in the comments. I enjoyed it. And it could be because I partake in all these old beverages that I bought. But y'all, I did this for y'all. <laughs> I did this because I love y'all. And I know if you like me, you done walked past the wine section in all these like 32,000 times and said to myself, I am not finna buy this cheap ass wine, but I'm here to tell you. You should. And when you do, tag me in it. Matter of fact, take a picture with it. Like this. <laughs> All right, y'all. I'm tipsy. I'm probably gonna pour me another glass of this, and uh, I'm feeling like this new little spot. Well, it ain't new, but it reopened today. Um, it's a little wine bar, probably about 20, 20, 25 minutes from here. I'm thinking I might put on some clothes and go there. I don't know if I do go, y'all going with me. But if I don't, I see you. Stop what you doing. Come over. Come over. Come on, come on.